caught on camera a two-year-old in California wandering the streets after being left alone by a carjacking suspect. Police say the child was kidnapped while inside his mother's car near Oakland on Tuesday. That child was eventually found safe and then reunited with his family. Luz Pena of our ABC affiliate there in San Francisco has the story. This shocking video shows the moment a suspect driving a stolen vehicle suddenly stops with a two-year-old boy in his lap, carries him out of the car, leaves the boy and drives off. The two-year-old boy is left wandering alone. Less than a minute later, a bus driver stops and calls for help. They found a child and the boy said a vehicle had pulled over and dropped the child off and then fled to a black male juvenile about two years old. People in the area begin to come out of their businesses to help the two-year-old. It just happened just right outside my, my front door right there. These things happen don't really surprise me anymore because it's just crime is on a upswing. This is the emotional moment when the boy was reunited with his mom in San Leandro. He had been in the back seat of their vehicle when the car was stolen outside their home in Oakland. We pieced together how the boy was found in San Leandro, four miles from home. Turns out a police officer in San Leandro had been listening to the Oakland police radio. I actually heard that Oakland was investigating a stolen vehicle that may have involved a child being taken with it. So once our officers were able to make that connection, we notified OPD that we had an infant found. Police officers arrived on scene and confirmed the two-year-old was the same boy who had been kidnapped in the stolen vehicle. It's a great feeling, I think, for all the officers involved who were able to reunite the child with their family members. It's always, you know, great to be able to bring about a happy ending for a kid. As the mother, as the mother held her two-year-old, she gave police a key tool to go after the suspect. In her car, she left her iPhone and AirPods key devices in this search. Her cell phone as well as her AirPods were still inside of her vehicle. So she was fortunate enough that she was able to get a friend's phone and utilize the Find My iPhone application. And um, luckily the two-year-old child was dropped off and they were able to be reunited. The mother tracked her phone miles away from San Leandro. Her car was all the way in Marine County at a McDonald's parking lot. The mother was able to give us continuous updates um, at one point showing that the devices appeared to be uh, on Tiburon Boulevard. Our sheriff's deputies responded um, and located the vehicle unoccupied in the McDonald's parking lot. The security camera footage showed a male and a female exit the stolen vehicle and then leave going northbound behind McDonald's. The car was recovered and now Tiburon police and Marine County deputies were set on finding the suspect. Plainclothes detectives, uh, along with Tiburon PD, uh, were able to look in the area and found two subjects sitting at a bus stop uh, near Rock Hill Road on Tiburon Boulevard. Back in Oakland, the mother and her two-year-old son are recovering. While thankful that even though her son was kidnapped, strangers and officers throughout the Bay Area made sure he came home. We don't operate on an island. We're not isolated. We utilize the help of other agencies, and we often extend our help as well. In San Leandro, Luz Peña, ABC 7 News. And Luz, thank you for that. We'll Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.